Welcome, 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 and welcome, and everybody. Hello, welcome to my ISK YouTube channel. All you beautiful souls, especially a beautiful little gorgeous soul this morning who sent a message uh, asking me to come to Ireland. Guess what, little beautiful soul? You've got a gorgeous box heading your way, filled with love and crystals and all my blessings. Thank you for making my day. So welcome everybody. Um, today we're going to talk about trolleolite. Um, there you go. It's I'm going to tell you how it's spelled. Um, T R because everybody's saying, uh, please spell the crystal. Oh, so I'm going to spell it T R O double -L, L E I T E. There you go. It's actually not called that. <laughs> Why? Well, because I've worked with it and I know what it does. So let me explain. This crystal is. The crystal of longevity. Take a look at it. It's absolutely beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at it. You've got your clouds. You've got your beautiful uh, sky energy in there. Blue, which is, for me, the energy of flying free, uh, flowing in the sea. It's absolutely gorgeous. Uh, I've had this from all over the world. Um, I've had pieces from Africa. I'm going to get this wrong again now, aren't I? Um, from Sweden or Finland, I'm not sure. Anyway, I don't know where it's from, I can't remember, but it comes from all over now. I think it was discovered once, uh, maybe it was discovered, I don't know, shut up Mark, it's not even important. You can figure all that out guys, all right? I'm not really into that, I'm into the crystal itself and the crystal for me is longevity and I'm gonna explain why. When I first got this crystal, I received about 15 pieces and I thought, oh, it's really nice. It's lovely. Like, what is it? I love the blue. I love the energy of it. It's gorgeous. What is it? And somebody was saying to me, it helped them go, go through uh, suffering and pain. And I went, oh, I can understand. I can feel it. And when you hold it, you can feel it. It's subtle. It's beautiful. But there's something on a very powerful level happening inside. So I'm going to explain what I saw and what I felt. Whenever I was going into hospital and somebody was going through terrible stress and they were told that maybe this is a chance of, of survival of this rate and that, I just used to get a piece of this and put it around their neck and say, hold on to it and work with it. On a client level basis, I had this piece for about nine years and I had lots of pieces of this. And how I worked with it was always, and this might sound weird, but I always work with it on the brain. So whenever I put this around somebody, I never put it around the, them like this. I would always say, I'd like to put a piece of this around you. And this is how I used to do it. I used to put it around them and put it high and tie and tie high. Why? Because I want to get it up here. I want this energy here. And then I'd say to them, when you take it off, right, when you take it off, when you lay down, put it here. And there's a reason why that, that is. Because when I was working with my clients to begin with, I always look at the crystal and to see where the energy goes on a client. And is there, um, like I'm working on say 10 clients and I put this crystal on a certain place. Is something happening at a certain point with all of the client, is there a kind of a memory that works on all of them at the same time? Or is it very individual? Does it go everywhere? And sometimes I saw a frequent, and the word is pattern I was looking for, that when placed on the forehead, there's something about this crystal of longevity that releases and fixes. There's a fixing process going on. So I don't know what that is because I am not a scientist, I'm not a doctor, but I do notice this. The client when wearing it, hi, or it's here and they're in hospital, something happens whereby their strength comes back again. They start feeling stronger in the mind. The fear disappears and all of a sudden they feel better and they leave the hospital. Or if I'm working on a client, they feel better and I don't see them for ages. And I found that giving this crystal to clients, that there's something about this crystal. And I wrote it down for nine months. And I wrote down longevity. 
And I, I actually wrote, this crystal has the power not only to heal, but to help people along their journey longer. I wrote down longer for a longer period of time. So they feel better for a longer, longer period of time. And what I meant by that is that you live a longer life. Why? A lot of my clients came out of hospital and lived a, a, a longer life. Whereas this, yeah, I have to be careful when I say that. Was it the crystal that did it? I'm just saying that there was a pattern that whenever I gave this crystal to somebody, I always felt that they're gonna be okay. They're gonna be fine. They're gonna get over it. They're gonna be stronger. They're gonna feel better. So this is how I saw it. When I'm watching energy around a crystal, I'm looking at the energy, not only at the crystal, but of the body energy. What's happening? Is there any movement of the cloud formation, which is uh, the energy? Is there any uh, residue coming off that client, which is negative? Oh, by the way, on a side note, where this with, uh, Tektai, it's absolutely fabulous. And this is the reason why, is because whatever's happening, the body system, them little soldiers, are running to a certain part of the brain and fixing something that has been either dissolved or broken or, and it fixes it. And then they feel stronger and happier and they last longer. Okay, that's one of the most profound things that I saw in the client. When I'm watching the top of the brain, at the side of the brain and the temples, there's a residue, an energy, transformation that, wow, that's that now it's becoming. So imagine uh, you're looking at this and this is what we're looking for, the blue, which is the, the, the beautiful color around somebody. But, but then there's this residue, which is blue which is white. And then all of a sudden it starts to change its color to full blue. So it's all, this is how I'm seeing it, but it's more gray when you're seeing it that way. So it's like, okay, that's weird how that's changing. So as you're working and watching this, you can see there's a transformation in the brain. You can put it down to negative energy being dispersed, probably right. But I used to see it as something is being fixed on a cellular level absolutely felt that and my clients would confirm that they would feel better but they would feel something different about the thought they're feeling the way they see things the way they hear things the way their balance is a bit like taking parasite cleanse something about parasite cleanse my teas that have made me more balanced uh, in so many ways i'm so much stronger so much happier so much just i feel better so there's longevity in clearing parasites so could it be that this crystal works in the very same way? Maybe it's clearing and, and fixing things that the parasites were killing. So you might have parasites in there, they're killing something in your brain that is causing you to have um, um, a less of a life, uh, a less length of a life. So when people used to say to me, oh, my friend's in hospital, it doesn't look good. Or, you know, what is it? Um, it, it's this or that, I, I'd either recommend this crystal or I'd recommend Sleeping Beauty, depending on how severe and serious it was. This one to me, it's not for severe issues, but it's for issues that are deep rooted and long lasting issues that have been there for years. People who have just gone in there out of a shock energy, I would always put this on them. It's a very powerful crystal. So this isn't just about sick people. This is about wearing this and keeping your strength, keeping your power, keeping your energy, keeping your balance, keeping your fitness, your health. It works alongside you. It helps you flow. It helps you feel free. It gives you that longevity that when you're in pain and suffering, you don't really see space and time. But when you're feeling better, then life becomes easier and it feels longer and happier. And that's what this crystal does. So I've named this the crystal of longevity. Now there's another crystal also that I called the crystal of longevity too. In fact, there's two more, but I won't talk about them. I have talked about them before, but this is how I feel this crystal works. The others work on a different level, much lower down, heart and stomach, but this is predominantly the mind. So you can, you can, easily say, well, if this is for the mind and you like to wear it as high as you can, or you like to use it here, 
there are certain things it's also good for, which is memory loss, any issues with um, the brain, anything that, that, that you have an issue with the brain, wear this crystal, okay? So issues above here, anything above here, so that's nose, eyes, um, mind, headaches, uh, whatever it is, monkey mind, uh, anything that's with your throat, anything around here, wear this crystal because I guarantee you something happens on a level, on a cellular level, on an energetic level that helps that. So give it a go and um, you might confirm this already with me. Um, so I'm sorry that I don't exactly know all the details where it's from, but what I do remember is that I've been, I've bought this crystal at many places around the world. And was it Africa? Maybe not. Maybe. But th th it was originally found by someone, probably a guy, and it was either Norway, Finland, or Sweden, somewhere. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Mark. Um, I don't know. Uh, but these in particular... Um, I think these are from, oh, I can't remember. I'll have to ask. I think they're from Africa. But they're all equally beautiful. A lot of people uh, at the beginning say, say, oh, I don't really feel too much with it. It doesn't matter. It's not about you feeling anything. It's about what it does. And you don't have to feel like you would do, like, oh, I need to know what Moldavite feels like. No, no, just wear it. Let it do its work. It's a constant, like, I'm where I'm here now, right? I've got uh, this small collection, okay? I can feel the energy coming up, and I'm literally, it's, it's not that hot, okay, in here. It's okay. I normally have the fan on, but I feel like my head is on fire. I feel like something is happening in my eyes, in my uh, temples, uh, all over here, my ears are going really sensitive and it's because I've got a piece of this on and I've got these here. So I think this is a beautiful crystal. It's uh, not really spoken about too much, but I, I, I love it. I absolutely love it. And any kind of crystal like this is also from, I think, either Finland or, or um, Sweden. I'm not sure... Um, but it's found all over in the forest. Now, this isn't a crystal per se. It's actually, um, I think it was derived by Mother Earth and how she fired it. So I think this is glass, but it's still incredible energy. I don't know. I can't remember the name of it, but it was gifted to me by somebody at a show. He said, I want you to feel, and I love it. I had three pieces and gifted two away, but maybe it's from the similar source and, and look at the color. It's so similar, eh? but it, I don't think it's the same. This is an actual crystal that is glass, but yeah, it's gorgeous. Um, other things that I like about it. The freedom is something that I feel like when you watch a butterfly fly away, it always feels like the feeling of feeling lighter, free of um, issue and trauma and trouble and um, issues and what ifs. So it's a great crystal for fear, great crystal for fear. If you suffer with anxiety, paranoia, any kind of issues in your life, wear this crystal and you'll find over the, the coming weeks, hey, I don't feel the same as I did two weeks ago. That's because this crystal works on that level. There's something about this crystal that I know as a fact works up here and heals and, and changes some energy inside you, which is on a physical level, as well as an emotional level, on a cellular level, it works in a magical way. So it's like your workforce are up there fixing summer. So just give it a go. It's, I hope I've done it justice because it is a beautiful crystal, and I'm not sure if I've ever spoken about this crystal before, but it really deserves a lot of love, and it definitely deserves your holding and wearing. Fabulous for any kind of spiritual work. No matter what you do, it brings balance and calmness into your life. If you're a psychic, if you're a healer, medium, doesn't matter what work you do, angel card reading, if, you're, if you work in any of those aspects of of high vibration where you want to find that nice level and you can work in a healthy environment, wear it because it changes your environment and makes you healthy. 
So I love it. I love this crystal. Absolutely love it. And I'm going to wear this one for about another two hours. And I'm going to do some meditating afterwards. And I've got a, a few crystals there I have to work on as well. I've just actually finished working on these overnight. So again, these are all about the head. And I've put energy into them as a a very unique energy into them as well, which is slightly different than what most people uh, would understand. So I don't really want to talk. It's more of a frequency that I've tried, um, like a Hertz frequency. And I'm going to see how people react to this crystal. But it was quite phenomenal. And I also did. Uh, I got my uh, singing bowl, which is a Moldavite singing bowl, and actually placed them inside and did 15 minutes of putting the Moldavite energy into these as well. So. I'll be very interested when people buy them and tell me what they say because I love to hear feedback. Have a great day. Thank you for going to markbyersky.com and buying your authentic crystals, incense and oils and teas. So thanks guys. Really appreciate it and I hope you love them as much as I loved working with these crystals. Link below for this crystal. Enjoy them. Take care.